Syracuse fans, football season is just over a month away, and there's probably a player you're forgetting about that Syracuse has on its roster, specifically its offense. I mean, there's so many weapons that are on this orange offense, so you might be forgetting about one in particular. Everyone knows about Kyle McCord, the five-star transfer from Ohio State. Who could forget about LaQuint Down? He had a great year last year for the Orange. And then the receiving room is full of talent. Aronde Gadsden, one of the best tight ends in the nation just a few years ago coming off an injury. He is on everybody's radar. He's a 91 in the new college football video game. And then beyond that, you have Zeed Haynes, who's coming in as a highly touted transfer from Georgia. You're bringing back Trevor Pena from an injury. Dan Villari was an interesting player last year. But there's another transfer that came into Syracuse's receiving room in the offseason that no one's really talking about, and that's Justice Ross Simmons, a rising junior in a transfer from Colorado State. He has all the tools that he needs to be a top-tier weapon for Kyle McCord, Fran Brown, and the entire Syracuse offense. Last season, he had well over 700 yards, and he was very productive at Colorado State against good competition. In week one, against a good Washington State team back when they were a power conference team, he had over 120 yards and a touchdown, and he had that type of production all year long. He played his best against better defenses, and now with his 6'3", 205 frame, plenty of speed to use as an outside threat when defenses are going to be focusing on Aronde Gadsden. They're going to be focused on Zed Haynes. They might be watching out for the speed of Trevor Pena. They might be watching out inside for LaQuint Allen. Justice Ross Simmons is going to rack up yardage and touchdowns, especially on the outside. I wouldn't be surprised if he was one of the favorite targets, if not the favorite target of Kyle McCord come this fall. So going into training camp, you're going to start to see his name more and more and more. And by the end of September, he should be a name that you know by heart. And you should be wanting Syracuse to target him every time he steps onto the field.